Initiating test number three. Subject is within the test chamber. Activate power. Oh, oh my God. Okay, do you hold yourself and clean that up? Test number three, unsuccessful. Test subject has been reduced to the same state as previous subjects. Clean up the test chamber and recalibrate the system. Let's do it again. Yes, Doctor. Now, you must be very diligent, Mr. Samantha. Owning a dog is a great responsibility. Yes, Father. Oh, I love her. You must feed her every day and walk her and be very careful when you play with her. You know she's going to have puppies. Really? Can I keep the puppies too, Father? We'll see, Samantha. One step at a time. Edward, tie the damn thing down! We can't have it running around during the test! It's tied down now, Dr. Maxis. Initiating test number five. Subject is within the test chamber. Activate power. Searching for vitals. No reading, Doctor. The subject has disappeared. Dr. Maxis, we've done it! Don't be foolish! Test number five is unsuccessful. Subject has vanished, yes, but has not reappeared at the mainframe. Recalibrate the damn system, now! Stand up. Stand up! Good. Look at me. Over here! Good. Now walk forward. Excellent. Further. Keep coming. It's all right. Stay there. Calm down. I order you. Kill it. Bring me another. Sophia, this letter is to go to the Reichstag High Command immediately. Gentlemen, it is with the utmost urgency that I draw your attention to the lack of funding being injected into the giant project. While I believe we are close to realizing the ultimate plan, we still have several years of development before it is ready. It would be folly to cut our expenditure so early in our development. As you know, early tests on the DG2 have easily outperformed expectations, and we fully anticipate mass-producing the Wunderwaffe within the next few years. Work on the matter transference has, however, come to a standstill. We simply do not have enough Element 115 to continue the experiments. The test subjects have survived the teleportation, but are currently unresponsive to commands and cannot be controlled. If we are to overcome this obstacle, we need to increase the frequency and size of the experiment. To this end, I suggest we find not only a regular supply of 115, but that we also find a larger conduit to channel the energy. Our operatives in America have informed us that the U.S. has a large supply of the element at the Nevada base. So time is of the essence if we are to stay ahead of them. This cannot be done if you cut the budget, nor can it be done if you insist on pressuring us into action before we are ready. I am, of course, available for discussion on the matter, but in the meantime, I will continue with the work here and try to win this damned war. Signed, etc., etc., Dr. Maxis. Initiating test number six. Subject is within test chamber. Activate power. Damn it, Edward! Did you set up the device correctly? Yes, Doctor. As per your specifications. If you had done it to my specifications, then it would have worked, wouldn't it? As usual, you're incompetent. What? Do you hear that, Doctor? Quiet, you fool! Test number six is a failure. But the experiment has caused some kind of electrical port to energize within the chamber. Well, open the door! Doctor, I don't think... Open the door! Now! Daddy, what are you doing?
going to pitch for us? Damn it, Samantha, I told you never to come in here. Edward, get her out of here. Yes, Doctor. What's wrong with her? Daddy, what did you do? Rocky! Come back here, Samantha! Stop her! Easy. Come here, Samantha. Good girl, Rossi. Gently, Samantha. That's not Rossi anymore. We must get out of here. What? Edward, what are you doing? Open the door! Edward, open this door now! I'm scared. Don't go. Stay by me, Samantha. Goodbye, Dr. Maxis. <laughs> But I'm all out of hope. I'll feel the same, my friend. Warning! The shield is now active. Damn it! I can't find my pills. And report to the barracks. They are coming. We must do what I must do. God forgive us all. To destroy our designated materials and report to the barracks. 